Well, since we're on the topic of food, I thought I would also read Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch. Look at that lunch, guys. Does that look like something you'd want to eat? I don't know if you could get your mouth around it. All right. Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch. Here comes Pete. Lunch? It is lunchtime. Pete is ready to eat. What should Pete eat? A sandwich would be nice. Yes, Pete wants a sandwich. Pete opens the fridge. He takes out a loaf of bread. He finds a yummy fish. He adds tomato and mayo. Pete looks at his sandwich. It is too small, something is missing. Pete knows what it, he needs. His sandwich needs an apple. Pete loves apples. His sandwich needs crackers. Crackers are crunchy. Pete loves crunchy crackers. Pete looks at his sandwich again. It is still too small. Pete is very hungry. Pete adds a pickle. Pete adds cheese. Pete adds an egg, two hot dogs, a banana, and a can of beans. Something is missing. Ah, Pete adds ice cream. He takes three huge scoops. Pete's sandwich is too big for Pete to eat. Pete wonders what to do. Pete thinks and thinks. I've got it, Pete says. Pete calls all of his friends. He asks them to come over. Everyone goes to Pete's house. They are all very hungry. There's his sandwich in the window. Pete shows them his big lunch. Are you hungry, asks Pete. Pete, Pete's sandwich is big enough for everyone. Dig in, says Pete. Pete's sandwich is good. Pete's sandwich is very good. Pete's sandwich is all gone. Pete's friends are full. They liked Pete's big lunch. Thanks for lunch, Pete's friends say. Thanks for sharing. You're welcome, Pete says. Sharing is cool. <laughs> 